So in this video today, I'm going to be talking about astaxanthin. And I'm going to address the question, should you bother taking what is probably the best antioxidant in the world? Uh, the pictures of the flamingos here is for a reason, because flamingos themselves get their color from astaxanthin. Um, so astaxanthin, talked about quite a lot. Here's a few clippings from the UK press. Um, but let's really try and get dig deep and understand what is this supplement and how does it work? So astaxanthin, what is it? And I have, well, here's our product on the right hand side, AstaShield. What's useful about astaxanthin? What are the benefits and how should you take it? My name is Dr. Peter Chadda. I'm one of the co-founders of Bespoke Biotics, uh, founded by myself, another research scientist colleague, and we've been driven by a passion to help people, which is what our business is about. So who is astaxanthin? Astaxanthin is a totally natural pigment. There are, a, they come from a group of compounds called carotenoids. Carotenoids like carrot is where carrots get their orange color from. Um, in this case, a long chain carbon atom like a molecule like this, um, astaxanthin is more of a red pigment. There are hundreds of carotenoids and they're completely natural and safe. Uh, astaxanthin, as I said, is found in, in marine life, but it emanates from plankton and algae, these tiny particles in the water. And it's been used uh, and approved since 1999 as a food. And so what's special about astaxanthin? Well, the human body is like a factory. It's busy producing all sorts of things like hormones, chemicals and what have you as part of our day-to-day uh, -day living. The cells are doing that. But as part of these reactions, free radicals are formed. Free radicals are like very, very aggressive particles that cause aging and cause damage and inflammation. The body is quite used to this and it soaks them up with what are known as antioxidants, which is why we have all the hype on TV about anti antioxidants. Um, vitamin C is an antioxidant and it's considered to be a good antioxidant. But astaxanthin is one of the best antioxidants known to man. It's 6,000 times more effective as vitamin C because unlike vitamin C, which can soak up one reaction, astaxanthin can go on soaking up loads of reactions. And that means these free radicals, which cause so much damage, are removed from the system. And it also helps protect the mitochondria. The mitochondria are the Duracell batteries in our cell producing energy. And an antioxidant as powerful as astaxanthin gives these mitochondria more resilience and power. So what are the benefits of astaxanthin? Well, having only been really used since 1999 as a supplement, research is evolving. But astaxanthin is an amazing supplement. As we said, 6,000 times more effective as an antioxidant than vitamin C. And it also has properties which means it can pass through the blood-brain barrier. So it can reach the parts of the body that other supplements can't actually uh, get to even. So we call it an adaptogen because it can work with lots of lots of different organs in the body, as you see in the diagram on the left. So the well-known ones uh, where people started off with astaxanthin are for the skin and eyes. So it's, it's good for wrinkles and it's good to improve your eyesight. Um, but as this amazing antioxidant can soak up uh, these free radical reactions, they really work as anti-aging um, a supplement. So things like fatigue, boosting your immune system, and as this antioxidant scavenger picking up things in the body that would otherwise cause damage, it's, uh, it's really good to protect you from cancer. Um, and on the left hand side, we see that the different aspects of free radical stress, but you can see it works in every system in the body. And there's um, a further article on our website if you need more detail about the specifics. Okay, so why AstaShield? Why our product? Well, basically, uh, we had a look around the world where you get good astaxanthin. It's not a cheap supplement at all to get hold of. Um, and we then decided to have um, ecologically uh, grown and cultivated uh, astaxanthin. So we've done this in a closed, we've looked at the suppliers to get a closed system. So on the right hand side here, we've got two pictures. 
One is of our closed system in which we grow the algae in which astaxanthin comes from in these closed tubes. And below you can see a sort of more open traditional biofarm which is exposed to, uh, you know, pollution which we don't get in our system. And it's also wasteful of water. And, you know, even things like bird poop can fly into that. So it's not so hygienic really as a system. Um, you can see the life cycle of the algae uh, in the tubes. As, as you see, it goes from a green stage to a red stage. It's only when it's reached a red stage is that useful for us as astaxanthin, the supplement. Now, lastly, I think we should be looking, how do you take it? Well, are there natural sources is the first question. Yes, there are natural sources, but to get a significant quantity of astaxanthin, you'd have to eat a lot of salmon or a lot of prawns. And really, it's, it's very difficult to obtain from that. And I've not heard of people eating flamingos. So we recommend having uh, between one and three capsules per day. Uh, take that with um, a meal, a meal which has got either some butter, olive oil, fat in it. It's probably better because that will mean that your penetration of it will be good. But our capsules come in an oil, uh, olive oil package, so you will get that anyway. How long before you see benefits? Um, you should see benefits basically in three weeks. Uh, it takes about that long for it to start to really make an impact. If you've got a lot of chronic health conditions, you can have to wait uh, double or triple that. But normally, most of the people who use astaxanthin start to see benefits in a few weeks. Uh, if, you're, if you always want to be sure, you can always measure how you feel before you start and then have a look at how you feel afterwards. So I'd like to conclude this and say, please have a look at our website. Uh, as I said, our products are produced in the UK and we have a variety of things 